The Federal Capital Territory FCT Development Commission bill passed a second reading on Wednesday at the Red Chamber of the National Assembly. The sponsor of the bill, Senator Wadada Aliyu, highlighted the significant challenges posed by the rapid growth of Abuja as Nigeria's political and economic center on surrounding towns. According to Aliyu, the bill aims to create a specialized commission tax with managing the development of satellite towns within a 60-kilometer radius of this FCT's borders. The creation of the federal capital territory has also continued to have significant social, cultural, economic, and political impact on the surrounding towns and communities. While Abuja has become a hub for governmental, political, and economic activities, the neighboring towns to the FCT have continued to experience various challenges as they are all de facto extensions of Abuja. They continue to suffer from inadequate infrastructure, limited pu public services due to overcrowding and ever-growing population influx. The satellite towns have no infrastructure. Uh, budgetary provisions are grossly inadequate. In fact, it is only the FCT budget that is funding the uh, satellite towns. But the FCT budget doesn't include funding of uh, uh, satellite towns. So for this reason, Mr. President, I support this bill. I wholeheartedly support, we will work out the modalities of the Constitution, but that commission is critical. FCT, we all live here, all the agencies are here, all the MDAs, all of them are here. So it does not make sense for us to ignore the realities of having so many people living in the capital. And the capital isn't just the few districts that have been developed. Those satellite towns of the FCT are those satellite towns that are within the constitutionally recognized boundaries of the federal capital territory. To extend it outside, <laughs> would mean amending the Constitution and then making a recognition of those places like uh, uh, Madaraba, Kefi, and several others around in Kaduna and other states. The bill received polarized reaction during the debate with some senators expressing concern over funding and the potential duplication of efforts with existing agencies. Uh, of course, when, it, when the report is brought to the um, floor of the Senate, we'll look at uh, how the committee is going to do the entire thing. And if it's okay with us, then we can pass it. Uh, but it's not in tandem with the Constitution, or it doesn't go well, um, it's not sensible, it's not okay, then of course we can uh, get it aborted. Those in favor that the baby read the second time, please say aye. Those against say nay. The eyes have it. Presiding over plenary, Deputy President of the Senate, Barao Jibrin, before passing the bill for second reading, stated that the bill will be configured at the committee level before its final passage. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.